Welcome back guys. Now, I want to quickly show you people that don't know how to import a uh, custom token in another wallet instead of OKX. So if you don't know how to do that, this is what you will do. Listen. Let's assume you have opened your trust wallet or your uh, MetaMask. So I will be using MetaMask for this video. You will see this where they wrote, don't see your token, import tokens. You click on it, make sure you, that you are using our uh, latest, latest was latest app. So make sure that you update your app. So you click on this import token. Click on it. Then you will see token address, token symbol, and token decimal. Now let me also, uh, this evening, someone attacked me that I use, or uh, I do what? I use my own address to give other people so that their own fund will be in my wallet. No, that's how that's not how it works. There is difference between contract address and your own personal wallet address. The meaning of that uh, contract address is that let's assume as for that A5 now. So if you want to import A5 into your MetaMask, there is no A5 in MetaMask yet. If you want to import uh, A5, you will need that contract address. That is the reason why I copied this contract address for my WhatsApp yesterday for people that watch uh, that yesterday video. So that is the reason why I copied that A5CA, which is A5 contract address. So there is difference between contract address and your own personal address. Now, this is the contract address from A5 by themselves. It is A5 that holds this contract, which means you have to use this uh, wallet to import A5 token inside your metaverse so that you get your own personal wallet address. For you to understand, if you check this wallet, you will see that it ends with 7654. So, and my own wallet is what? So, if you check my own wallet here, my own wallet ends with 7C7C. So, if I click on import, then I get back to copy that contract address. You will see that. So, let me cut it then. Import. As you can see, I only copy that. Uh, wallet. I need to copy the CA. So this is the personal address detected. Enter the code token contact address. Now this is it guys. As you can see this is the Arbitrum 1 wallet address from A5 World. So this is the wallet address that they provided. Click on this wallet address. Copy it. So I will, I will still be dropping this wallet address, this contract wallet address, into what? Uh, into the video description, you will just copy it and go back to your MetaMask. So, so before you click on this impulse tokens, switch from this, uh, any network that it is before and switch to Arbitrum 1. We will be using Arbitrum 1 here. Then click on this import token. Just click on import, import token. Then paste the address that you copy from that you copy from this video description or from A5 website. So paste it. So as you can see, the remaining will detach automatically. So this is the token symbol and this is the token, token decimal. So just click on import. So click on import. Then you see that it will automatic, automatically import into, into the MetaMask. So as you can see, this is the A5 here. So the reason why it didn't work before is that I don't switch this network. So it is it is in call before. So if you go to call and click on import import token and then try to paste this. So it will say personal address detected so that is the reason why i get that error that time so make sure that you switch your network to arbitrum one it is uh a vive was under arbitrum one because a is a token it's not a blockchain and this one is a blockchain so switch to arbitrum one then import your token paste the wallet address once you paste the wallet address and uh you try to do what the remain will detach automatically you just have to Click on import like that. So that's how you will do us. That's how you will got your got your 
own A5. So once you have successfully imported that, then you click on this A5 here. Click on it so that you, if you want to, or uh, let's assume, if you want to receive your own, uh, let's assume so someone want to send you A5. So you just once you once you do as once you click on this A5, then you click on receive so that you can get your wallet address. That is where you get your wallet address. So you just copy your wallet address and copy it for that person that want to send you a vibe. So or uh, you copy your uh, let's assume you want to use it for your okay uh, for your KYC phase two in in the A vibe app. You just copy your wallet address and get back to your A vibe app. Paste the wallet address there. Then do the other thing. So that's how you do it. So hope you love this video. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification bell for the next one that is coming. See you in the next one. Bye.